what's up guys we're here with another vlog and today's topic is on are you worth fighting for who determines your worth who determines how valuable you are how do we know if we're worth fighting for what does that even look like what does that even mean meaning how valuable you are within your relationship what is your contribution to your relationship what do you have to offer that's what we want to talk about today in this vlog what are some characteristics that you obtain to know that you are valuable and that you're worth fighting for. I would see wisdom as a good attribute in a relationship that would make me a keeper. <laughs> you give good instruction. Your ways are wise and you're guided by wisdom. I would say I'm financially wise. Mm -hmm. Making good decisions with my money, which is pretty important in a relationship. You have to have some sort of financial stability. And self-control. relationship, yeah. Self-control yes. definitely is important. I would also have to say that I'm pretty committed. When I'm talking to one individual, I'm talking to one individual. I'm not talking to seven other guys at the same time or <laughs> looking around trying to see like who else is out there. Like, no, I'm pretty focused and committed in that relationship. Being a hard worker, um, knowing how to get a task done and when I get it done and having good time management skills. Not Wasting procrastinating time. and stuff. Sitting around doing nothing. Right. <laughs> Lazy ball, <laughs> peace ball on the couch. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Having good morals and values, mm -hmm. um, that's really important. Not just doing whatever, whenever. I set a bar somewhere and not just going with the flow. If you have no boundaries or any standards for yourself, then like, you're sure to fall anywhere. Exactly. You know? mm -hmm. and, yeah, because you don't have anything to guide you. It's also important to have open-mindedness um, within your relationship. Being optimistic about things and being um, able and willing to learn new things and take on new challenges. Endurance. I just don't give up when something That's gets it. difficult. I work harder. Yeah. I just don't say, ah, couldn't figure it out, let's move on. <laughs> like, no, I, I do it until I get it. Let's stay and let's make this work. Let's uh, communicate. Communication is another huge right. attribute um, that's important within mm -hmm. a relationship. Let's figure out why it's not working, you know, let's try to understand one another. Which brings in humility mm -hmm. and patience. Another one would be being generous. You're generous with your time, you're generous with your money in a relationship. It's kind of like, what's yours is mine. Right. And like, <laughs> you need to understand that because yeah. in a relationship that's really important to be generous with everything. Now, all of these characteristics that we have named are um, not definite answers. They're just characteristics that we obtain and that we think will be good attributes within a relationship or that will be useful within a relationship. Right. And determining your worth and if you're worth fighting for, you have to consider your process. What did you have to go through to get where you are today? What is the journey that you took in order to be who you are and to stand where you are, to have what you have today? Wow. <laughs> Where do I begin? <laughs> I would have to say first, I I had to renew my mind. <laughs> mind renewal in the form of like positive affirmations and just being motivated and being driven and, and going after things and setting goals and setting plans, like those kind of mind renewals. I wouldn't have done any of those things if I still thought the same way that I thought 12 years ago. With mind renewal, it doesn't mean that, yeah, the situation has changed for you. It's exactly. just mean that you have changed your mind within the situation. Mm -hmm. So it's, you think differently about that thing. You think differently about lust. You think differently about your finances. So you know how to handle it now. Right. Better. Yeah, yeah the mind development, that process, and like yeah. the, yeah, the books that I have to read. We've um, read a lot of books in order just to get us through certain circumstances within life, to teach us things uh, while we're in the circumstance, while we're in the right. situation. Right. The challenges that you have to go through right, in life right. to, um, to be who you are. All the long nights that you have to cry. You're worth the smiles because of all the long nights that you spent alone in your room, crying out, reading those books, developing yourself, developing your mind that it may persevere in yeah. these situations. And all the sacrifices that you had to make right. to, to not to not just be like the crowd. I made lots of sacrifices to, to not just do what everyone else was doing, but to do what Kiana wanted to do so that Kiana can have some different results in the crowd because the crowd right. <laughs> wasn't always making the wisest choices. The direction they were going wasn't set up for 
complete success. Those kind of things I had to do differently to get to where I am today. That's the journey that I went through. That's the process that I went through. And it wasn't easy. Like you said, I had many challenges right. to get to where I'm at. Another one being is your past has made you who you are today. So don't regret or look back and be like, oh, I wish that didn't happen. I wish I grew up differently. I wish I had a mom and a dad. Don't look back over life and be like, I wish I could have. What if? No, you are who you are today because of your past. That's a great thing. Embrace it. Enjoy it. Move on from it. Learn from it. Teach your children about it or teach whoever else is around you what you learned from that because your past has taught you some things. Because of everything that you have been faced with and everything that you have to learn, like that's who you are and that's what you stand on. That's like, that's your value. Right. That's what you're worth. You're great because of all that you went through. Mm -hmm. And you're great because you've learned, not that just because you went through it, but because you've learned from those experiences. Right, exactly. And um, that's what makes you great. Mm -hmm. um, and that's what makes you worth it. So they're not willing to fight for your worth. Don't be afraid to walk away. You don't have to hold on to something that isn't appreciating you. But also don't want to take take on something that's not deserving of your work. Don't want to um, take that person that's not that's not fully there with you. The person that doesn't understand the path that you walk. The person that doesn't understand that they may have to learn some things or change some things in order to right. accommodate who you are today. We keep falling for for people that don't deserve us. Yeah. Stop wasting our time on people that don't deserve all of you. They don't yeah. deserve all of you. They don't deserve your heart. They don't deserve your emotions. They don't deserve your time. Of course, all of this is easier said than done. Anyone just arrives there right. and it's like, oh, this is a piece of cake now. Yeah, like, it's a learning process. Right. All learning and growing. Yeah. And, and we're willing to go through that process with you. Don't be afraid to, to comment below, to message us. We are here for you guys. We want to do this journey with you. We want to walk this process with you. If you need any help or you need any encouragement and extra push to know how valuable you are and to know that you are worth <laughs> it you're worth so much more than what what you thought you were worth so just remember that you are totally worth the wait if you guys have any questions or comments or anything that you guys want to discuss with us of course you can comment in the comments below or personally email us or contact us in some t sort of form we're willing to help you guys we're willing to walk through this process with you guys you are not alone thank you guys for watching this video vlog we hope that it has helped you in some sort of form and of course like and subscribe thank you guys for watching and we'll see you next time